Hey guys, uh, Distrax here, and uh, I don't know if some of y'all may have questions about how to record on uh, Windows Windows 7, because I know I did, and it's actually a really easy fix. If if you have a webcam like I do, and you want to know how to record, all you have to do is whenever you go to Windows Movie Maker, Windows Live Movie Maker, you open it up. And like I said, this is for this is usually a problem for people who have webcams like me. If you do have a webcam, you know, usually whenever you're in here, I mean, I, I, I used to have Windows XP. I used to look for, you know, uh, where it captured from video device or whatever. I used to look for that. I couldn't find it. And I looked through all this stuff and import from device. I, I, I didn't know what to do. All you do is you go to this little blue drop down thing, go to options. Go to webcam, and here it will have your webcams. And like me, I already, you know, did my DVC device. I already connected it and everything, and I also have my webcam. So usually, I'll actually be set on this from default. So once you have your DVC connected and everything, just HP webcam and change it to Dazzle. Click OK, and you go to webcam video. Wait for it to load, and there you go. Now, I mean, you, you know, you can do whatever. You can start recording, and you can record, and, you know, just do whatever. You get a hit marker. That's cool. And then you can stop. Save it to whatever. Name it whatever. Name it hit marker. Save it to my desktop. Uh, yeah. Click save. There you go. You can also edit it and stuff. So that's just a little thing for you know if you want to know how to configure it with you can configure your DVC with you know whatever Windows Live Movie Maker and stuff. And I I mean I recommend this. I recommend using Windows Movie Maker. But I mean if you have Pinnacle or Pinnacle Studio 12 or something like that, I, I would definitely recommend using that more. But if you just have your laptop and you may have lost your product key or your installation disk or something like that. I mean, this is this is just fine, and you know you can go be above and beyond and download Sony Vegas and render and all that crap. But I mean, uh, this is this is pretty much it. So uh, hope this tutorial helps, I guess. And if you uh, have any questions, just do in the comments below. And you know, uh, see y'all guys later.